Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. Um, and I'm super excited. I got some fun stuff. Nothing crazy, but enough. Let's start here. Okay, well that's crazy. Look at the size of that tag. It's a fun little lantern that, oh, it lights up a lot. That's pretty. I thought that would be really pretty at night if I'm out on my, excuse me, out on my patio or for a wedding, like an outdoor wedding. Um, I think that's just plastic, but it's pretty sturdy. So a little lantern. I found these. Now, I know that the Aquaphor version of this is like seven or eight dollars. This is Body Revitalizing Jelly Stick. It's just like um, Vaseline. It's petroleum jelly. But there is um, some other things in it to make it hold its shape. But it's like a jelly ball. It's a jelly thing. No scent to this one. So I grabbed these because uh, for moisturizer. Always, I, you can rub that on your face at night before you go to bed. And then there's the cocoa butter one. And they came in the same box. So you had to pick one. Smells like cocoa butter. Smells like summer. Um, ingredients, petroleum jelly. So these are, these are just like Vaseline sticks. But they're $1.25 and not $6.99. I grabbed this. I grabbed this for my trip uh, to go into my like medical kit, which I am making a video of my laundry kit and my medical kit and a piece of luggage that I have. But this has um, two screwdrivers for your glasses. It has the little like screw, extra screws and a cleaning cloth, extra. I will take this out and put it into another vessel because I don't need to take all this plastic with me. Um, what I like though about this specific kit is the size of the screwdrivers. The other ones are a little small, like they're just tiny. And I like the size of this because I'm blind, you know. So you get two screwdrivers um extra nose pieces some different sized screws and then a little cleaning cloth so all of this i will put into a little baggie and stick it in with like my medical stuff in case i have a need for um my glasses break it's always something handy to have i got this non-medicated vapor inhaler it's supposed to be a comparison to the vix one Hi, Alex. Now, we all know I had the other brand, the salt, pink Himalayan salt inhaler. But I was curious. And I don't know that I have ever seen this specific one before. I'm opening it. Peel here. Okay, well, I would love to peel here, but how am I peeling there? I'm trying to get it open. It says peel here. Oh. Did I tell you I was blind? Aha, here we go. Okay. And then you, ooh, that's strong. I like that a lot. So when I'm traveling or headachey, also this works if you're nauseous. So I will keep that in my purse. Um, for all the time. The Himalayan one is good, but that one is definitely stronger, which I like. Um, also for my medical kit, I picked up these bandages in case we get blisters. These are adhesive healing gel bandages, waterproof seal, mild or multi-day use, helps promote fast healing, seals out water, dirt. These are hydrocolloid, hydrocolloid badge um, bandages. So they're a little different than a regular bandage. They are like rubber and they seal your, your wound. So if you get like a blister or something, they help promote and they keep the dirt and stuff out and you get four in here. So that's not bad at all. So those will go in with my, with my medical kit. Um, I grabbed this, it's called a hand sanding block kit. 
they always sell the sanding blocks, but what I liked about it was this plastic thing. They can, you can hold it and maybe your hands don't get roughed up, but it also comes off. And then you can just replace the block and keep this plastic piece. And I do a lot of crafty sanding stuff and I thought this was perfect. So I grabbed that. This is definitely random. They have insect repellent wipes, which I thought was fantastic, especially if you're going camping, any type of outdoor nighttime activity. I am a mosquito, not repellent. I am a mosquito magnet. They love me and bite me. And so like when I go downtown to watch the concerts and stuff, I need to have these with me. So I can throw this in my picnic basket. Um, I like that it's wipe. Now I would say I will have to bring some other wipes to clean my hands. That's okay. A plant-based repellent. Repeals mosquitoes, last up to two hours. Family care, do not flush. These are obviously for bugs. You get 50 applications. So I thought that was great. Especially if you have littles or younger kids that maybe don't like to spray, that would work. Um, also in the hardware section, I grabbed this tool. It is for painting. I really wish I had it when I painted my doors, but it's for edging. So you don't have to tape everything. You just push that up on the edge and paint along and then you can wipe this off. It's also a straight edge. So if you, any type of house cleaning, crafting, whatever. I like that it has these little holes here so you can hang it if you have a pegboard, but it's just a straight edge. I will have some painting coming up. So I thought that was important. Um, I just grabbed these. They are just two dowels. I thought maybe for um, cross stitching, it might come in handy. These are 15.75 inches long and they're, point, they're half inch diameters. But you can always cut them too if you need them and it's a nice manageable length. So just some dowel rods. Grab those. Um, for my grill, I got this. I replace this every year um, just to clean my grate. I'm going to grill today. Um, it has a scraper. It has this side here that you can do the, the grit, the grates, and then a metal and a abrasive side. But I like it because it's long and it keeps my hand away. They have these every year and I get one every year. Um, they had some more reusable travel bags. These are the ones I like that have um, the boxed bottom. So they will hold, let's get these open. They will hold more. And they're cute. Um, and I, I use them. I have one right now that I have a bunch of sweetener and drink mixes in and stuff when I travel. So how wide open that gets. Like that would hold a decent snack for your purse. I'm a snacker guys, I can't help it. And then this is the same thing, but larger. But it would hold like a sandwich or something of that ilk. And they're cute, they have little cacti on them. I definitely will put this in with my travel stuff um, when I'm getting ready to pack up for the season. For my trip, I mean, I just have a bucket of stuff I'll go through. Um, I grabbed this, but not for this. I'm hoping, and it fits perfect on the inside of this. Now, obviously I'll take that out. But my thought is I can paint and decorate that and glue it to the center here. Yeah, it fits good. Hot glue it down in there and then I can decorate that however I like. So that circle, I'll fill in with some wood filler and then I can sand it down and then paint it and put any type of decoration I want on it. And then I can put it right in the center here with a little bit of hot glue. Alex, Alex, leave him alone. Alex is such a bully these days. Hey, come here, come here. You leave him alone. Um, I found the office supplies. Here, we'll do our thumbnail. Pins, look at the push the colors. 
And then this one comes with some different size push pins, tacks, and straight pins that you can put on a, your bulletin board. But they're all in the same color family, the pastels. And then this desk set has two magnets, some push pins, some binder clips, and some paper clips. And they're all in the same colors too. So I thought these would be super fun office supplies for whatever. These are coming to work with me. I have a metal filing cabinet behind me. So the binder clips, the paper clips, and the magnets will work perfectly at my desk at work. And then I have bulletin boards in my office upstairs. So we'll do that. Get excited. Parchment paper. I ran out, so I grabbed two. So just be conscious that when you're baking in the oven with heat, you use parchment, not waxed. Wax paper is that. It's waxed and it will melt on your food and you'll get wax in your food. Wax paper is good for like freezers, uh, packaging, baked goods and things like that, but not heat. Parchment paper is what we use in the oven. And I got a couple comments asking, so I wanted to cover that. So I grabbed two rolls. I use this religiously because it saves um, cleanup in my oven. And if you cook keto, there's a lot of cheese involved and egg and things tend to stick, but they don't really stick to the parchment paper as much. Um, I also cook with a lot of silicone bakeware for the same reason. Okay. Now let's see what we got. Oh, I remember this. Um, I picked up a bunch of cards, uh, some birthday cards for my office. Succulents are it this year, guys. And so I have three birthdays coming up um, for my staff. And then my brother turns 60. So I grabbed four birthday cards. That's important. And then. Oh, I got these for this winter. I don't think I need them right now, but they are peppermint infused moisturizing gloves. And I'm thinking this winter when my hands get super dry, moisturizer and put these gloves on. And then these are infused as well. So I don't think I need them now. My hands aren't dry, but they will be come winter. So I picked those up. Um, I grabbed some grape drink mixes because I like them. All right, now for my, also for my staff, um, I get them a little treat on their birthday. So I grabbed three of these Kit Kat birthday cakes, which I thought was super appropriate. So I have three of those. And then I have, one birthday is Monday, so I got her a bag of the Ding Dong popcorn. And then I'll get them a little $5 gift card to our cafeteria at work for coffee or whatever, but a little popcorn, a little Kit Kat, and a gift card. And then the other two, I will look for a treat for them. Their birthdays aren't until June. Um, so I have time for that. I'm cleaning up my mess here while I go. That's how we should roll, right? And then my last bag, I don't have a ton of stuff here, but my last bag, I picked up two more of these. I am obsessed with these guys. They work so well. You get 12 wipes and they are good for um, stains and they work. So I have some at my office. I have some that are going to go in my luggage to take on a trip and some are in my purse just to have with me. I bought another one of these toilet cleaning gels. They work great. There's not, I know the ones from Lysol have a very heavy perfume smell. I don't smell these, but I see the bubbles and the soap working as I flush my toilet, which is why I like it. So I don't get a big smell from them, like that clean smell. It says it's ocean fresh. I don't get a lot of that, but I 100% see the soap going around. So I picked up one more of those for my upstairs bathroom. Um, I wanted to try this Gain Odor Defense Super Fresh Blast. Um, I use these in my washing machine all the time. Uh, set boosters, nothing of any excitement. Um, also for my trip, I grabbed this because I can plug this into my uh, international converter, power converter, and gives me three extra plugs. And I can throw this just right in my suitcase. 
So I grabbed that to plug into my power converter. Um, oh, I did get one more pack of these for my uh, one of my staff's children. She has two daughters. So I grabbed an extra one of those just to give her with some coloring books. Um, I found another pair of Elvis socks. These just say Elvis, which I love. Low cut. Designed in Canada. Made in China. And they're just ankle socks. And I have somebody to give those to. And then I grabbed a rope basket because I think these are adorable. I don't know. It'll probably go, if I had to guess, in my bathroom and hold some of my um, makeup. Because right now I have pottery in there, which is fine, but I'm afraid it's going to break. And if this falls, it won't. It won't break. And this is a good quality. It's a little rope basket. So that is everything I got at the Dollar Tree this week. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will talk with you later.